getting ready for winter That's how we spend our summer Then we spend the winter making a list of all the things we need to do next summer To get ready for winter We're going into our fifth winter in Carmine. Carmine winters are harsher than Grand Forks winters. We used to live in Grand Forks. A whole nother story. Anyway, winter can be a cozy time up here in Carmine, but it's in winter that you find out what has to be done to make your house a little or a lot cozier. Next winter. In the winter, ice used to form on the roof of the fifth wheel and in the spring it melted and flooded inside because of leaks in the roof. So last summer one day I was up on the roof of the fifth wheel sealing the leaks and a friend pulled up and got out of his car and said, what are you doing? I said, the usual. He said, ah, uh, getting ready for winter. This summer, let's see, we're insulating the crawl space and sealing up drafts in the floorboards. It's a 110 year old house. Then we're insulating around the electrical outlets, opening a hole in the wall so warm air can get up the pipes under the stairs. And we're buying a little wood burner for one corner of the kitchen, even though we've got propane heat in the living room. And then we'll spend the rest of the summer and fall collecting firewood in the bush when we're out walking the dogs, all in aid of. Getting ready for winter. That's how we spend our summer. Then we spend the winter making a list of all the things we have to do next summer. To get ready for winter.